Hey guys, what's up, Tamara here. Today I am back with another bookish box unboxing. As you know, I just adore this box. I can see myself um, continuing this box for a very long time to come. I'm excited to jump in and see what's inside, but first, let me show you what I'm drinking. As I usually do, I love to share what I have in my mug or cup or glass or whatever I'm drinking out of. And today I am drinking tea by David's Tea. It is the pumpkin chai tea. It is very, very good. It is a black tea. So you have to pretty much boil, have really hot boiling water when you steep this. I throw a little sugar in, a tad of um, whipped cream to make it creamy. You know, not too much, but just a tad and it is marvelous. So um, this is actually, I think, my canister from last year. You know, I reuse the canisters. Um, so yeah, it's, it's just amazing. It even has little orange bits of pumpkin candy. It's amazing. It smells awesome. Yeah, I totally recommend it. You might not know this, but today is the first day of fall, so drinking pumpkin chai on a day like today is just perfect. All right, so let's get this party started. As usual, this is how it looks on the inside. I gotta say, this is a very lightweight box compared to the last few I got, so I'm curious to see what's in here. Um, this is the September box, if I failed to mention that earlier. There are seven items in here, so that's good. So let's just, just jump right in. The very first thing I see on the top is First Edition Tea Company Pride and Prejudice tea. This is a citrus and roasted mate herbal tea. So I love tea, as you know. Um, yeah, makes three cups of tea and uh, nice. So I'm definitely looking forward to trying this. The very next thing I see is by J and Co Jewelry. It's in a nice little box. Uh -oh. Open, open box. There we go. Oh, that's really cute. It's really cute and dainty earrings. These are actually earrings in the shape of a feather. That's really cute. It's called uh, Le Vos A Earrings. Le Vos A Earrings. So yeah, I like it. It's like they're silver. Hopefully they're sterling silver, it doesn't say. Um, so it's probably plated. So yeah, cute. I'll definitely wear these. I love studs and I love silver. Up next is, hmm, what is this? Custom Creations Gift and Decor. I'm not sure. Oh, it's a bookmark, I think. Okay, so this is a Katniss Arrow Pen and Highlighter Holder by Noni's Custom Creations. Now, I'm a little confused by this because it says it's a pen and highlighter holder, right? But when you look closely, it has an elastic on the back. So I'm not really sure how it's supposed to hold a pen or a highlighter. I don't know. I'm slightly confused. If someone knows what this is, can you let me know? I mean, I would probably either put it on a book, like as a book holder, um, you know, a page holder or decoration for a planner. I don't know, it's kind of odd, I'm not sure, but it's definitely not a pen and highlighter holder. It's definitely not that. Up next is a bookmark, and I love when I get paper bookmarks, especially when they are watercolor and really cute. The text on the bookmark says, you could rattle the stars, and this is from the book Throne of Glass. So yeah, this is really nice. I'll definitely be using this. Up next, Sticky notes, more sticky notes, fabulous. As a planner girl, you can never use too many sticky notes. It's a really cute container. And this is Bookworm Highlighter and Matilda Sticky Notes. Okay. The quote on the front says, all the reading she had done had given her a view of life that they had never seen by Rodel Dahl Matilda. So yeah, it's really cute. Definitely will use these. Next, aha, this thing has been making its way all around the internet. 
It's been on Instagram, Twitter. I've gotten emails about this book. It's really got a lot of buzz around it. So this was a little sneak peek and I do think it's an extra because it's not listed here, but very cool. Up next, I see a pen and it says, females are strong as hell. Yes, we are. Females are strong as hell. And that is um, by Jar of Button. And this is a Kimmy Schmitz magnet. So if you watch this TV show, then you probably have heard that phrase before. I don't watch Kimmy Schmitz, but I hear it's really good. That show, I think, won an Emmy for comedy or something like that. Here's the highlighter. So earlier with the bookish um, Matilda sticky notes, it came with a highlighter, which I missed. So the highlighter just comes off this way and it looks like there's a pen on the other end. There is, so it's a pen highlighter duo. And so this came with the sticky notes that I had found earlier. Last but not least is the t-shirt. This is my favorite part. Oh, I love it. I seriously love it. It says, don't you tell me what to do, Harry Potter. Now we know who said that, don't we? It is a Hermione shirt and she says, don't you tell me what to do, Harry Potter. Yes, very cute and it's red and it's bold. And yes, it's just the business. I love it, it's very cute. Okay, so we have the t-shirt. We have the highlighter, pen and sticky notes. We have the bookmark. We have this arrow that I think might be a bookmark or something else. We have the pen, we have the earrings, and we have tea. So this was a very nice box. Oh yes, don't let me forget. And the book sample. So the value is still really good, I believe. This was a really good September box. I love um all of these things. I'm still really confused by this. So somebody, you guys, please tell me what that's for. Otherwise, I'll be creative and use it for something random like my planner or something who knows i don't know um if i forgot to mention earlier the theme is literary ladies so that everything in the box makes sense except for maybe the book excerpt um i think that was just an add-on and it really didn't fit the theme but otherwise everything was spot on so yeah i will be here again next month hopefully the october box is um horror driven or something like that that would be really cool leading into halloween anyway if you'd like to check out the bookish box i do have a link below please use my referral link that will give me a small credit toward a free box if you enjoyed the video please like and share this with your bookish friends i would really appreciate that and also while you're clicking around hit the subscribe button so you don't miss a new video until next time happy reading bye guys